Hey, what's going on Raider Nation? Welcome to another video for the Black and Silver Way. It is your host Dylan and today's actually going to be a little different. This is actually a video response to another Raider blogger. His name is Knight of the Shield. Knight of the Shield has a YouTube channel I think for about three or four months now. Just another Raider blogger like the Raider community has now and I'm going to leave the link below to the video I'm actually responding to and in the video he asked other Raider bloggers to say what does that shield mean to you and I think that's a good topic to talk about. So Knight of the Shield, I am responding to you and this is how I feel about the whole Raiders organization and pretty much why I do what I do for that shield and logo. So, um, you know, in the last three years, I have become very known around the Raider Nation. Three years ago, I was a season ticket holder. People had no clue who I am. And now when I go to a Raider game, people can't stop talking to me and people can't stop stopping me. And it's awesome. I've met so many people into the Raider Nation. I've met a lot of good new friends. Everyone's like a big family. It's a big community. People that don't even know me in LA and people that have met me through Instagram and actually have not met me in real person act like they're my really good friend and they always comment give me feedback and a lot of you guys on YouTube same thing we got the YouTube community everybody's always commenting and letting each other know how each other feel uh, a lot of you guys have been watching me for a couple years now and I just really appreciate that support guys and that's one thing about this shield that's different than all the other teams in the NFL is it's a nation guys it really is a worldwide nation there's fans out in New York they have Texas booster clubs they have freaking Oklahoma booster clubs. There's a lot of diehard Raider fans that I have met through this experience of being involved in the Raider Nation. It's insane. I never thought that that's the way it was when I used to just kind of watch the Raiders and wasn't really into blogging or doing anything else. And uh, now that I'm really involved in it, it's really overwhelming on how cool and how big the Raider Nation is. You know, back you know, three years ago, I think almost in 2012, 2011 season, I was a season ticket holder there for two years. I had, I didn't know anybody. And once I started Raider blogging, so many Raider fans always look for news and are so into the team. And we've, we, it's crazy because if you think about it, all the other YouTubers or all the other teams for YouTube that blog about the teams around the NFL, you know, so even the Patriots, okay, successful organization, five Super Bowls, uh, 49ers, five Super Bowls, Dallas Cowboys, five Super Bowls, um, you know, all the other organizations with a lot of Super Bowls and actually a pretty big fan base as well. It's just different with the Raider Nation. We have three Super Bowls and we've been losing, you know, no playoff appearance in the last 10 years. And on the YouTube community and on Instagram or on anything else, there's so many more. We have like almost 10 Raider bloggers, guys. And we've had four and 12 seasons for almost 10 years now. Three Super Bowls. It's just our fans are different, guys. I don't care what anyone says. Our fans are way different than anybody else in the NFL. It's just awesome. I'm really glad to be a part of the Raider Nation. It is one really big happy family. And, you know, a lot of you guys, you know, some of you guys be hating on me or some people have different opinions and everything. But that's just how life works, guys. I'm just glad that I'm a part of this organization because it's just, I don't know, everything about it, the mystique of the Raiders, Al Davis, it just grabbed my attention when I was younger. I was actually a Pittsburgh Steelers fan all the way till I was seven years old. My dad is a diehard Pittsburgh Steelers fan to this day, and he used to wear, put all this Pittsburgh stuff on me when I was younger. I had no idea really about anything, you know, that's just, if you're brought up like that, you're brought up like that. And my dad took me to a Raider game, like I said, when I was like eight years old with John Gruden, Tim Brown, Jerry Rice. Man, Charles Woodson just coming onto the team. It was a wrap, guys. I saw the passion. I saw so many people dressed up. It was a lot of fun. The environment was exciting. I just can't wait to get back to those days, man. And that's these long days, these long, hard 10 years, guys, of losing and, you know, draft busts and money pits, you know, and seeing Al pass away. We've dealt with a lot of shit, Raider Nation, and it's time for us to step up and it's time for this organization to start competing for that fourth championship. And, uh, you know, repping Raiders every day, I have thousands of hats, guys. I have so much memorabilia around my room. And it just never gets old for me. It's a lifestyle, guys. It's not just a team. It's a lifestyle. And that's what I think about the Raider Shield. And I, uh, it, you know, it's just a lifestyle. It's not just a team. And it's like one big family. So if I see you guys out at the Coliseum or anyone that you guys see me in public or anything, please stop. Take a picture with me. Say what's up. Get my number because Knight of the Shield said in his video... His friends of just saying hi and bye at the Coliseum, now everyone stays connected. They have each other's numbers. They tailgate together. They do other events together. So 
you know, through this whole journey, I've met about five new solid friends that are really cool and really good guys. Raider Central, Raider J, Steve Bay Area Raider. There's a few of you guys that I can't even mention. There's so many different people. I'm just saying... Um, Thank you Raider Nation for everything you guys have done for my blogs and everything for my channel. And uh, you know, we're going to go through this journey together. We're going to see the bandwagon attack. We're going to see so many Raider fans coming out of the cuts. I bet you if we start winning guys, my subscribers, my views, everything's going to triple because when everybody finds out, when all the bandwagon fans find out that the Raiders are on top again, they're going to want to rock this shield and they're going to want to go full force with it guys. So uh, that's going to be the video for me, guys. I just, uh, I'm really excited for this year. I have a lot of passion for the team as always. Even if we lose, you know, all the games next year, it's not going to change a thing. I will lose my mind, though. <laughs> you guys will see another Eagles rant, and I will get crazy. But other than that, I'll never lose passion for the team. I'll never lose passion for that shield. And as Knight of the Shield says, I always will protect that shield and no matter what. So I'm feeling the same way, bro. And, um, you know, shouts out to all you guys who watch my videos, like, comment, subscribe. Thank you for everything you guys do day in and day out. We have the best fans in the world. And that's all I have to say. So I'll see you guys on the next video.